YouTube, what's good? It's your boy Will, back in the building with another video. How are you guys doing today? Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I am Will. Thank you guys so much for hanging out with me today, checking out this video. So today I got a really cool video for you guys. We're gonna be checking out the Govi Lyra floor lamp. This is basically a LED strip inside of a floor lamp. First thing you will notice is that the box is pretty small, which means there's gonna be some assembly required with this. The lamp, when it's all put together, is a total height of about 4.9 feet. You get over 16 million colors of RGB deliciousness. You get your IC technology, which is gonna give you those independent controls with eight different segments. You also have your WW, which is dedicated warm white and cool white LEDs. That's gonna give you more of an accurate 2200 warm white Kelvin all the way up to a cool 6500 Kelvin when it comes to the whites. This lamp uses up to 1500 lumens of brightness. This is gonna work with your Google Assistant and your Amazon Smart Assistant as well. And you also have access to the Govi app. This also comes with a remote. You have over six different music sync modes and 25 beautiful scenes. And you can also do DIY as well, where you create your own themes and lighting effects. Govi did send this product out to us to review and make this video, but I'm not sponsored or anything. And everything in this video is uh, my opinion. In this video, I'll be sharing with you guys the unboxing, how to set this up with the Govi app, how to connect it to your Amazon device, all of the app features, including the 25 different scenes, the assembly and all the stuff that this has to offer. So if you're ready and you're interested in like a really cool, a really dope floor lamp, sit back, relax and enjoy. Let's go ahead and get to the unboxing and let's see what we get. So the first thing you're gonna get out of the box is gonna be your Govi pamphlet, which gives you all of the support information in case you need to contact them. The next thing you're gonna get is a quick start guide. You're gonna get your user manual. So the next thing you're gonna get is this nice little classy remote control. This remote uses RF technology, which basically means you don't have to be trying to point it at like a sensor or anything. The Lyra floor lamp also comes with a remote control holder that you can stick onto the Lyra floor lamp and it's magnetic. So if you're one of those people who like loses remotes, Govi got you covered. The next thing you're gonna get is two sets of screws. You get four extra small screws, two extra tall screws in case you, you're a screw loser or in case you lose screws. Magnetic screwdriver LED strip, which has a diffused silicone rubbery material. There is a connection for the LEDs to connect to the base. The next thing you're gonna get out of the box is gonna be three aluminum pieces. Then you're gonna get three smaller aluminum pieces. And lastly, you're gonna get your lamp base. And this has a Govi logo on it. On the back of it, there's a cable coming out which connects to the controller. So how do you put this all together? You slide the smaller aluminum pieces into the taller aluminum pieces and you use the small screws that connect it. The middle section has four spaced out screw holes and the very bottom section has four screw holes but the bottom two are close together. Govi actually has a two minute video that shows you step by step which I found very helpful when I was putting my lamp together. Before you even connect this to the app you already have functionality with this remote control. If I click the color button I can cycle through a few different colors. If I click the warm button it's going to take it to the 2200 Kelvin and if I click towards the cool side so now it's on 6500 Kelvin and then the quick function for music hey 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 it's right there on a the remote and power on and off so pretty sweet so now we're going to go ahead and connect this to your govi home app all you have to do is go on your smartphone type in the app called govi govi home should pop up and i already have this app but if this is your first govi product what you're going to do is create an account with govi once you create your account you're going to hit the plus in the top right corner, we have the H6027 model. We're gonna click that, and as you see already, it immediately found it. We're just gonna call it something very cool, like floor lamp. Hit done, and then right here, you enter your Wi-Fi credentials. Just keep in mind that this only works with the 2.4 gigahertz Wi-Fi connection. It's gonna take a few minutes for this to load up the latest firmware. It blinked and that means that it was successfully updated. Okay, so now that we have this all set up, we're gonna go ahead and click on our floor lamp. And simply at the top, you can see you have your power on and off. If you click at the top right corner, you have your settings section. And here you can change your device name, 
you can reset your Wi-Fi. It shows you the user guide to connect to your Amazon and Google Assistant and a whole bunch of other stuff. Next thing down, you have your timers. So you have four timers that you can set with this device. And you also have a wake up and sleeping, which is also a timer, but it will gradually get brighter to the set brightness with wake up and it'll automatically dim to the set brightness for sleeping. Keep going down, you have your brightness. So this is 100% brightness and this is 1% brightness. So next section, you have your modes and this is your music mode, as you can see. Uh, we're gonna go through that a little bit later, but next you have your color. So in this section, you have the ability to adjust your light in segments or solid colors and there is a, a few other functions in here so let's just go through it real quick so right here at the top they have a new section called recommended color schemes and if you tap on this you can choose a style so let's choose that you can choose a scene we're going to choose this one and the color matching method we're going to do well, I kind of like that. So yeah, you can also save to my colors as well. Moving along, this is gonna be your segmented light right here. So in this section, I am able to select all segments and click red, and this will make the entire lamp red. But if I wanna be real fancy, what I can do is deselect all and click on a few of them and let's do dark blue and as you see it changed just the segments that i chose to that blue color making a gradient keep going on you have your relative brightness this will let you adjust the brightness of the selected segments of light right now i have the bottom top and a portion of the middle at 50 percent and all of the other segments are at 100 percent brightness but if I move it up, you can see it gets kind of purpley. You also have a gradient function right here. This is supposed to make the lights blend better. Um, but in my experience with the gradient on or off, I don't really notice a big difference. It's very subtle. So you have your color picker right here. And I can simply just pick around on this little color bar and choose all the colors that I like. It's gonna be your cool white color temperature and this one is the warm white color temperature. You also have a color wheel and here you can go ham and choose any color that you desire on the wheel. Scrolling over, they put some emotions here to associate with the colors and you also have more color options as well. It's a lot of colors in here. Moving along from color, we're gonna to go to scene modes. So I'm just gonna go ahead and click on all the scenes over music and let you experience the scene modes.
you have 25 different scenes with this lamp and I'm sure Govi will be adding more. You also have a DIY section and here you can go ahead and create a scene to your desire. So you can name it, you can adjust this in finger sketch, you have gradient, breathe, jumping, stacking, crossing. All of these words mean different lighting effects. We're just gonna click stacking for now and I'm gonna choose some colors. And if I apply this, now it's stacking the colors that I chose. Instead of stacking, if I choose crossing and hit apply, now the effect is crossing between the colors that I chose. So it's really cool that you can basically choose any option that you want. And you even have a combo option. So if I do combo, this is the scene that I just created, which is a combo of a move and a rainbow. I mean, you can honestly sit here and play in this app all day because there's infinite possibilities. If I save this and then I hit the share button, I can actually share this with the world. Now I'm going to show you guys how to connect this to your Amazon device. You want to go to your Amazon app, you click on more, you go to skills and games, you search for Govi and you want the Govi home skill, you hit launch. And this is gonna prompt you to log into your Govi account. So here is my floor lamp inside of my Amazon app. So I can actually choose different presets of scenes. It used to be where you can only recall colors from like your uh, Amazon devices, but now you can actually voice assistant to turn into music. So if I say change floor lamp to bounce, set floor lamp to Christmas. Yeah, I really love that they have now integrated uh, voice with music modes and scene modes. I've been using the Govi Lyra floor lamp for about a month and a half now and I really enjoy the vibe that it creates inside of my space. Pros and cons with this device. Pros, you have endless possibilities when it comes to RGB effects and so many already preset good scenes that I really like with this lamp. I feel like it fits in pretty much in any setup. I think that Govi has once again made a really dope product. Like I said, Govi did send this to me, but little did they know is I would have bought it. That's neither here nor there. So my number one con with this is gonna be the wire placement. This lamp is meant to illuminate your wall. The wire is on the wrong end. So basically it's gonna be hard to hide the wire. So my next con with this is gonna be if you're using this on carpet, it's it's kind of hard to like get it to stand up perfectly straight due to the very slim design of the base. Another thing that I did notice about this is it is not a completed one size piece. You can see like the three different segments that you use when you connected this together. But I mean, that's only if you're like really up on it and looking at it. Now I will mention the price. I'm not really sure if this is a con or not. It does cost you $150. Now this is the highest Govi product that they have to date. I kind of think that it is worth the $150 due to all of the features that this has to offer. If you're interested in checking this product out, I will leave an affiliate link down in the description. If you purchase through my link, it's gonna save you 10% and it also will give me a small kickback. I got some more Govi products coming, but I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please don't forget to leave your boy a big thumbs up, subscribe to my channel if you have not already, and remember guys, never stop creating. Deuces!